I bought my first record when I was 14, but it was like slow, collected, didn't think that, you know, it would be something that I'd latch onto. And now I have 800. And I only, I would say I'd started like properly buying records maybe five years ago. We're gonna start with The Piano by Herbie Hancock. This was one of the CDs that I found downstairs in my living room when I was growing up and kind of getting interested in jazz and other styles of music. It was really special hearing it on record for the first time. It's a solo piano record. It was really warm. You could hear a lot more detail in the room. Feet, pedals, keys sometimes, and like little sounds from him. Not many, but enough to really make you think about him being in a room by himself and creating this stunning piece. This is um, Kokoroko's newly released EP. I've been waiting for this record. Like, I've seen them live countless times, um, you know, their first gigs. This record is the culmination of a really beautiful couple of years of growth from this band. When we record to tape, it has a completely different sound to when we don't record to tape. To me, it's more real and it's warmer. All the jazz records that I grew up on, that was a norm. Do you know what I mean? Um, that's the kind of warmth and room sound that I've been striving for. So this record is by an art collective um, and it's called Earthy Cover Orchestra, Volume 5. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a stunning record. It's, um, it's their interpretation of some very important and very influential South African music called Kuwaito Music. When I started collecting records, I wanted to go and get the records that were really important to me as a teenager and, you know, listening to them on a really, really good system and doing the record justice also became like a kind of, not an obsession, like one back from an obsession, but like, I, you know, I'm a musician, I'm into good sound, you know, like the most frustrating thing is when you don't have good sound and it's not as it was meant to be heard. Hearing these all again um, and finding new things to listen to, like I, I definitely appreciate sound so much more since I started playing and collecting records and you know analog sound systems. 